All right. Done to your 455. Greased every single grease point on the tractor. Changed the oil, changed the blades. For the old blades, they're really bad. Uh, the real blades are a little bit longer and they're completely flat on the ends and they're extremely sharp, like at the lift. Those are bad. 60 inch commercial, ultra compatible. Broken headlight included. How good will that sell? We're not selling it though. This thing is staying. This thing is staying after it dies. After it dies, we'll probably fix it. <laughs> But sadly, um, well, really not sadly, but, uh, this is my grandpa's tractor. It's got nice little headlights. I don't know if they work without the key on. Oh, there they go. Headlights. I'm trying to do this here. I guess I'll warm start it now. It's warm. Jiggle, jiggle. It's got so much compression that it's nuts. Hydrostatic, all-wheel steer. I guess I'll show you how that works. Like I said, tons of compression. It's got so much compression that when I shut it off, it shakes the entire tractor. A good this much in every direction. It's nutty. It's really, really cool. It's got shaft drive. We got the deck set all the way up. We did the uh, coolant. We put the coolant in because it ran out. It has enough compression though when I shut it off, it knocks the light out. The light's just. It's just wasting space right now. That's why the other one isn't even there anymore. <laughs> well, yeah. Inline three. Liquid cooled John Deere 455 diesel. It's a Yanmar. It's made in Osaka, Japan. It's really, really cool. I'd basically recommend this tractor to anyone. John Deere 455. It's got power steering, all wheel steer, shaft drive, 60 inch deck, diesel engine. It's great on fuel. Uh, I mowed some good 50 acres the yesterday and however much I did today and it was right here yesterday like a four, uh, three quarters now it's half so it's really good on gas um, it's really smooth runner <laughs> as long as you don't keep it at idle at idle, the compression kind of gets to you, and it just, just then kind of runs like this. Kind of shaky. Kind of wibbly wobbly. Uh, the grease points are easy. There's just one, a couple over here. Now they're really dirty, but 
I think the hardest one to get was under here. It's that shaft back there. You can see the little coupler. We had to grease that. And then the uh, U couplers back here. They need a little bit of greasing. Well, you greased one point and it went everywhere, so. That's pretty easy. Well, yeah. It's a nice tractor. Hydraulic everything. Differential lock, the whole nine yards. What more could you ask for?